Hello everyone. 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 Hello everyone and welcome to reacting to my old videos. So I've been doing YouTube for just over two years now and a lot of the time I don't go back and watch my old videos just because I feel like it doesn't really bring anything new out. Sometimes I'll watch videos from like a couple months ago just to see if like the quality has changed at all but I haven't really seen some of my really old stuff and I kind of remember what it was like so I thought I might as well bring you on the journey of reacting to my old videos so here's my channel page I'm just gonna go sort by oldest here we go I'm I'm pretty apprehensive I'm not sure what to think because I remember doing the videos but I don't remember I remember being really proud of them obviously because I feel like everyone should be proud of like their first videos because it's such a scary thing to do to start YouTube but, you know, after things progress, you kind of look back and you're worried. So we're going to watch uh, my channel trailer, which doesn't apply anymore. Uh, maybe I should make another channel trailer. I don't know. I don't know. But this is the one I made then. So let's see. <laughs> let's see what it's like. I think this is definitely copyrighted. I think we're going to... We're gonna just mute that for a second because that's definitely copyrighted. But I did this whole... So this is the first day I was using my editor and I was just like throwing stuff in and seeing what I could do. And you know what? For a first edit, it's not that bad. And at the time, like I thought this was really cool. And you know what? It isn't like the worst thing in the world. It doesn't really apply to my channel anymore, but I didn't know what my channel was going to be then. So I just was like, let's just put everything in there. And of course, had you told this abby that in a couple months she was not couple it was like six months she was gonna be doing voiceovers and in a year she was gonna do a face reveal she would have been like <laughs> right then um no so that was that at the time it didn't get that many views obviously and yes i used to like my own videos maybe i should just yeah just let me mm -hmm. i don't know it's just something you do when you're uh, starting off as a creator <laughs> look at this description <laughs> Get ready because Abigail Pinehaven is joining the Star Stable YouTube Club and she's ready to edit. Short movies, long movies, reenactments, music videos, tributes, tips, and humor. Cool. <laughs> I was I was ready for YouTube. Yeah, this this girl, Nellie Darkwood, she was Nikki something before. She was one of the first people to comment, and this was like the best comment. I could have gotten for like my, my first video. Say, so, seems interesting, you earned a subscriber. I was like, Phew wow i'm getting subscribers like oh my goodness that was honestly the best day for me getting getting subscribers okay so we've watched the channel channel trailer it was it was okay for first video it was okay the um equestrians go, don't give up is just another edit that i did but the first video that got any sort of traction that was like significant was star stable life hacks with a bonus life hack because i i remember at the time life hacks were very popular so i was like oh definitely gotta do one then let's see i think i'm gonna have to mute most of these because um, I think they have copyrighted music in them. Yep, and I still liked my own video. <laughs> Good job, Abby. <laughs> and, like, I didn't know what to do with, like, the bits in between where I needed to have straight text, so I just put this, like, really generic, like, galaxy pink background. And this really good screenshot of the Star Stable database. <laughs> if you notice, um, that hair... I don't wear it anymore, but I used to love wearing it because it was like a braid and it was like cute. And then in one video, I think it was Star Stable Ideas video, someone commented and they were being really mean and they were like, oh, you and your fishbone hair. And I was like, okay. And after that, I went and got a haircut. Um, not in real life, in Star Stable, but I was just thinking that's such a strange thing to make fun of someone for, their Star Stable haircut. I don't know. Oh, look, look at that, my outro. <gasps> yeah, this was, this was my original outro. I did, it was just this generic photo. I didn't even take this photo of Jorvik Stables. I just had this, thanks for watching, hope you enjoyed Myra Sh Sword Knight. I remember her. I did this, look at all those cool effects I've got for titles and transitions. Look, there I go again. I'm still like proud because I don't think at any point would I 
take these videos down because I think it's really important to show like your progress like I didn't just start off with like like loads of subscribers and um like really high quality videos like I did start off like most other youtubers do like you you're not sure of yourself you're just kind of experimenting trying things out and i think that's really important to show as well sasable gender equality sasable boys did all right that's a mouthful of a title <laughs> but it did actually okay because i think it was a really controversial topic but I remember discussing it and it being like hey wait a second why isn't there boys in star stable and like at the time i know that video doesn't present much of a case it's more of like a look at what we're missing but later on i do do a video where i present all my arguments oh this is this is the first voiceover video oh wait i think that's the first time i used my intro so I've used it since, um, let's have a look. I've used it since the 14th of August, 2017. So I've almost been using it for a year. Uh, a year? No, it's two years. It's, I've almost been using it for two years. My Lord, to be honest, this, I was so, so proud of this when I, I did it. It's, to be honest, a lot of people ask me how I did it. It's just a green screen horse with an animated background with a title on it it's nothing like super extravagant but it ended up really really like professional looking and i haven't changed it since and i really like the song i think it like really suits my channel like the upbeat um whole thing but that is the first time i've used that and then i just used it ever since so let's let's hear the voice um <laughs> Hello everyone and welcome <gasps> to my first commentary video. I'm really really excited to put this out there to see I sound like a different person. Oh my word It's it's definitely partially the microphone Because I it was my sister's microphone that I was using and it wasn't it was like really it was too it was very professional but I didn't know how to use it so it ended up being like really like low quality because i didn't know what i was doing with it but my god i literally sound like a different person oh my goodness kind of what the reactions are and i'm also really really nervous to record it because i'm in a house full of people and that's just really embarrassing yeah i rem oh my gosh i literally remember sitting in my room and like but like I kept glancing at the door like really paranoid like oh who's listening like they probably think I'm so crazy like honestly I was so like it was such a weird thing to sit down on your own and like talk to like to a screen like just on your own it's just so strange and the fact that like I'm like so mind blown right now like oh my goodness Oh my goodness, I literally sound like a different person and I had no confidence either because this is the first time I'm doing anything like this and I'm like, oh, I hope it's okay. And like, I'm clearly not happy with the way I sound. I'm so uncomfortable. Oh my goodness. So, I wanted to thank so. all of you guys <laughs> who have subscribed for getting me to 300 subscribers. Thank you. I had 300 subscribers. I had 300 so that was that was the 14th of August 2017 I had 300 subscribers so that was that was about six months maybe more than six months after I'd started like six months is technically like a long time but when you're starting off the traction is really slow but that's like normal because you have to like get into the rhythm of everything and you have to like build your way up if you will but like i'm i'm literally like this close to the microphone because i didn't want to talk loudly oh my goodness oh well what is this video about thank you so much i i didn't even imagine the the channel's getting this big so thank you so much for oh. all the support you've been giving me it's absolute i genuinely though i was obviously i started youtube like with no intentions of like being as big as like anyone i just started it because i felt like it and like to see i i was so thrilled when i first hit 100 subscribers i was like over the moon i went around the house jumping with joy i was just so happy and like 300 obviously was massive for me as well oh my goodness oh that's <laughs> my heart i honestly remember these days and things are so different but like they're 
it's like a good thing that I was so nervous and everything because I learned to be more confident in myself and obviously you guys helped with that too because if people were like ew she sounds really weird like I probably wouldn't have done as many videos as I have but like hearing people like say like oh you're doing really well or like oh I really like watching these videos it like reinforces it like that's why I love watching smaller channels and like kind of hearing them not be 100% in themselves and then being able to say yes you got this you go girl you just take that voice over and you do it and I've got one long term project the only thing I can say is it'll be out on Halloween and I'm really excited oh I know what video that is it's perfection I started making that in like August my goodness <gasps> wow I was well prepared. Videos these days do not, like I don't have any long-term projects going at the moment. So far it's looking really, really good. So I'm hoping that you guys will enjoy it as much as I'm enjoying making it. Because I- Yeah, that was always a big thing. I really enjoyed making videos, like really enjoyed. And especially Perfection and, um, what was the other one? Unbroken and Cold. I enjoyed every single moment, even the moments when it wasn't working and I couldn't get it right. I still like enjoyed the whole process of doing it. And that's why it was so great to see those videos do so well, because it's like, it's just having something that you really love and then being successful as well. is just, it's the best thing. I feel like that's the key to success, you know. If it... <laughs> Look at me. <laughs> oh, that's so cute. I'm like, oh, I feel like that's the key to success because I enjoy doing it. I still have the same mentality now. <laughs> I literally just said this like a second before. Um, but obviously enjoying doing it. That's so weird that I knew that back then. It'd be nice to kind of get to know me a bit more and, you know, kind of interact with me. So I don't want to be one of those YouTubers that are like just pumps out content and doesn't talk to anyone. That is literally the same thing now. Like, <laughs> I'm I'm the same person. Obviously, I'm the same person. But, like, my core values haven't changed at all. Like, I still completely believe in that. That people should, like, interact with their audience. I can't. I actually cannot. And I also wanted to start this thing where I give a shout out to... Yes, I did this for a while. At the end of the video, so there would be the bit basically the outro you guys see now used to be longer it used to have an extended section where the audio would kind of drop off a bit and i'd put up a comment on screen and say thank you like for commenting and stuff and give the person a shout out i only did that for about four or five videos because after that i was getting too many um too many comments coming through and it was taking up a bit too much time so I stopped doing it but that's so strange because I was new I knew that that was like gonna help me because I would be like oh wow I really appreciate you guys like look you're up on screen you're you're like in the video and like now I have like way too many to be able to do that but I used to give shout outs oh my word um yeah so that's all I wanted to say for this video I think Yes, that's all I wanted to say. <laughs> I like, okay, didn't know where I was I going just, with that. Uh, you know. So this is the first time I did an outro. Let's see what I said. Because I'm always looking for recommendations. And that's all I have to say for today. So thank you so much for watching. And I'll see you in the next video. Bye bye. That is it. That is the first time I did an outro. So it's changed quite a bit. But that ending bit... The one where I say, um, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye bye. It's like, it's, it's like the toned down version of what I do now. <gasps> That's so strange. I was like, th thanks, uh, uh, thanks for watching. I don't think I said, I hope you guys enjoyed. I changed that actually. I was at one point I got confused and I started saying that. So, um, that's, that's what I do now. What was my intro actually? Hello everyone. Hello everyone. I have the same intro except I'm a lot more aggressive when I say it now. I'm like, hello everyone. <laughs> no, the back then I was like, I didn't know what to say. So I was just like, hello everyone. Hi. <laughs> Let's see what my actual outro Bye. screen has. Same, it's the same thing. Except that. I didn't know. <laughs> So I used to see YouTubers have this thing where they had like videos on screen and I didn't know that it was in in YouTube that you could add the overlay so I just I, I just put the videos in the outro like this is uh, you can see it's like squished it's because I put boxes for some reason and then put the videos inside the boxes I didn't know that it was like these aren't clickable you can't click these 
learning process, but all right. I think it's, yeah, the, the title's changed. A Here it is. thank you to Awesome Horse Productions for commenting on my last video. Thanks, guys. I kind of want to watch the Q&A. Jesus Glitch actually didn't have any voiceover in it because I didn't think it needed it. Let's see Q&A. What did I... This was a follow-up video. Oh, my God. Hello, everyone. And there it is, my intro. I actually did it with some, like, passion this time. I was like, hello, everyone. <laughs> and uh, copyright free back um background Welcome music. Welcome to my first Q and A video because I have way too many horses that I never do anything with. <laughs> oh, oh! Did you hear that? I was like not sure of myself, and like I did kind of like a nervous laugh, and I didn't edit it properly to like quickly go on to the next bit of, of voiceover and there's just this like awkward silence oh no thank you to everyone who commented i really appreciate it i was kind of scared that nobody would comment but you did yeah that was a real fear of mine of saying something or like asking a question or like asking for a favor and like people just ignoring it <laughs> like i used to like if I wanted to ask something, I wouldn't ask it just in case nobody would answer. Obviously, that doesn't really happen now, but je definitely when you're smaller. Um, so I was really worried that I'd be like, go and Q&A questions and nobody would say anything. So, But they did, so that's a good thing. It's It was just about like building confidence for me. And that's it for today, and I will see you in the next video. Bye-bye. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, no, Jay's my bye bye. It's like bye bye, but then it was like bye bye. <laughs> I was like done. Oh my goodness. Yeah, that's like an actual point though. Like I used to be really nervous about asking questions because I was worried nobody would answer. Then after that, I did the face reveal. Oh, do I have to watch the face reveal? Okay, can I just say, I hate how I look in this video. Like I genuinely hate how I look, and I've contemplated taking it down before but as i said before i think it's really important to show progress and even if i look back and i'm like oh wow i wish i hadn't um looked like that um i still think that this was a really important step for me and i woke up on the day ready to do a face reveal like i hadn't thought of it i just woke up and was like right you know what i want to do i'm gonna do face reveal and I did it and without that like motivation it could have been another year before I did a face reveal it was just at that time I felt ready and whilst I look back and I'm like ew <laughs> but I wouldn't I probably wouldn't be sitting here with a face cam if I hadn't done that video so I think it's an important part of my history so I'm going to leave it up but I just think I look really weird in it gonna do a face reveal in three two <laughs> yeah i was like two, gotta create one. the drama and put a sensor on my face oh that was my old bedroom as well i don't live there anymore i moved but oh there's all my stuff in the back one ta-da it's my face oh. like like <laughs> that probably wasn't a good frame to pause it on let me just okay right like i i look like the same like i clearly am like the same person but my eyeliner was really bad on the day and I had my hair up, which is something I don't do anymore. Just because it must be something with the cameras, but it looks really strange if I've got my hair up. But I was just answering Q&A videos and... First question. It's strange. Um, is Abigail your I was name? nervous about this. I know that. I was really nervous. I was really nervous. That's why you can hear me nervously laughing quite a lot. See, like, what is that? I've got... The problem is, is my eyeliner isn't even, so it makes my eyes look really uneven as well. Whereas normally they're not like that, I think. I hope so, at least. My background, it's like my um, wardrobe. <laughs> Sorry. Um... Oh, I'm so nervous. I'm like not sure of myself at all. Because this is the first time of like being on camera. And like, if I'm being completely honest, I'm not a photogenic person at all. Like, I struggle to look really good in photos. That's just the structure of my face. So going on camera was a very scary thing. But at the end of the day, oh my gosh, this video's half an hour long. Was I literally sitting there talking for half an hour? This is like almost a continuous video as well. Like there's not that many edits. You that maybe nobody else has done yet. Can you shush? 
traffic, honestly. Um, yeah, so... <laughs> oh my goodness, did I really just say that? <laughs> oh my god. Did I literally just say traffic, honestly? Oh my god, I'm so sassy sometimes. That was like completely uncalled for, like you couldn't even hear it, but I think there was like a truck going past or something. Um, will you do- Yeah, see, I- Nowadays, if I'm- if I've got something like I have to read off of, I'll like write a paragraph and then memorize it and then say it, whereas at that point I was just like- I just had written down what the questions were and then I was just ranting on about them and that's why the video is like half an hour long. Like, <laughs> who genuinely watched half an hour of me ranting? Because I'm not even going to watch that. I don't know, there seem to be a lot of- Yeah, this video is literally just me ranting. I genuinely haven't watched this video in ages because I didn't like how I looked in it. Um, and I didn't realise how much I rant. <laughs> My goodness. But as I said before, staple video, I needed to have it done so that I could move on. So this i thought this video was really important because a lot of people will only see the videos from a lot later in my channel like these kinds of videos and they'll see like okay except miranda craft bloopers but like they'll see like the numbers on them and the thumbnails and like how the video's style is and they'll automatically assume like a lot of people forget that you can check mostly any channel and if you find like they're really old videos they're not the best quality and they're not like to the standard that they might do today but that's like the whole point because it's like it should be a journey and you should show the journey from the beginning to the end and that's why even though like i might cringe at some of the really old videos and like be shocked at like how different they were at the end of the day i was that person at one point i was in that position i was still learning and I still am like I'm by no means am I, am I saying that like nowadays I'm like you know a perfect youtuber because I'm not I make mistakes and stuff with face cam for example I'm still learning how to edit it properly but it's just something I have to practice so that means I have to do more videos with face cam and it's just as simple as that sometimes you need to do more videos in the areas you're not comfortable with so at the end of the day it's about learning and it's about being able to look back and acknowledge how far you've come so that when you're stuck on things and when you don't have motivation you can find that because you found it before and I think that's really important as well. I honestly didn't start off with very good stuff at all but I eventually worked my way up and I like you know a lot of the stuff I did on my own and I'm really proud of that and I think that's the most important thing is if you're proud of your channel and you're proud of where you've come from because I certainly am. Speaking of being proud, you should be proud of you too. You guys are such talented and wonderful people and I'm so lucky to have you guys as viewers and supporters. These two years on YouTube have taught me so much and I never in my wildest dreams imagined I could get to where I am today. So thank you for clicking on my videos. Thank you for laughing. Thank you for commenting such creative and kind things and thank you for making my work feel loved. But don't forget that at one time, I had only one subscriber, and I'm pretty sure that was my dad. So we all have to start somewhere, and I still have a long way to go. But this, you guys' support and love, makes it all worth it. You make it worth it. But anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed. Stay positive, and I'll see you in the next video. 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 Bye bye. Bye bye. Bye bye. Bye bye. Bye bye. Bye bye. <laughs>